welcome back to my channel I hope you're all doing good in your life so today's video is something very different that I've not done on my channel obviously you would have seen it is a nail polish collection video this was requested by one of you and I thought it's really good idea to do a nail polish collection video because I don't have a lot of nail polishes and therefore this video might not be so long let's hope so and uh, yeah I've never done anything on polishes on my channel so I thought it's really fun to do this video I hope that you like this video and let's just get started so this is the overview of the number of polishes that I have this is a Federal Rocher container in which I am storing my polishes if you're following me on snapchat you kind of know the misery behind me and my polish storage in fact this idea was given by one of you only so yeah this is a Federal Rocher container and I have all all of my polishes stored here the ones that I reach out for maximum or that get a lot of use out of uh, them and then some of them are right here these are the polishes that I store in a plastic pouch this kind of a plastic pouch which I got from a local beauty store really inexpensive so that's how I store my nail polishes and then all of this goes inside of my vanity drawer so I'll take you through these polishes one by one now. This is the first polish and this one is number 211 Coral Craze which is an absolutely beautiful summer coral color. I absolutely love this polish and highly recommend if you want like a wearable summer nail polish. The next one is a number 218 which is uh, Crazy Berry. This is a polish which is um, especially good for the winters because it's like a berry colored deep red deep wine color and it, this one looks good even on the legs. Next one is a 215 Keep Up The Flame and it is this um, bright vibrant red color. It's not a deep dark red but a really nice vibrant red color. This next polish is number 012, Devil Wears Purple, that's the name and it's a gorgeous purple with uh, shimmers in it so it's kind of it looks like a multicolored purple, it's really pretty, you can see the color reflexes in this bottle, this polish looks absolutely amazing. The next one is called 002. Pinkalicious and it's exactly what it says it's pink polish uh, a cotton candy pink um, this doesn't look that good on my nails uh, but I think if you have really fair hands this will look awesome the next polish is called 704 glowing wine and it's a kind of a I would like to call this more of a dark pink color um, but yeah it's really good this is also like a shimmery polish so it's not a matte polish and it looks really nice on hands as well as legs. Next is Ladies Night 006 and it's a beautiful navy blue color. Um, it's like blues are really hard to work whether it's in makeup or nails but I think this is a really beautiful um, kind of a metallic-y blue. Looks really pretty. Next is 005 Wine and Dine and it's a beautiful wine color with shimmers in it as you can see. This is my absolutely favorite polish to wear on hands as well as legs, winters or summers but this is more like a winter appropriate nail polish. Next color show polish is Matinee Mauve 605 and it's uh, from their Glitter Mania collection and it's this beautiful pink glittery pink nail polish. I love this color and I love this uh, you know glitter polishes but the only thing I don't like about these is the glitters are just too hard to take off. So these are not my uh, you can say my absolute favorite but yes if I'm in a mood to flaunt something glitter on my nails I definitely reach out for these. Since we are talking of glitter I'm going to mention about this 603 Starry Nights which is like a black glitter nail polish. Um, really gorgeous nail polish honestly if you want black with a twist you need to have this but like I said the glitters are a little hard to take off that's why they are not some of my favorite polishes but I love this color anyways and the last color show nail polish that I have is 703 firewood brown which is this burnt brown sort of a, it's kind of like a grayish brown color and this is also from their bright sparks collection I don't know if this is a permanent line or what but this polish is really nice uh, 
not that dark not that light and kind of gives a different look to the hand okay I finished these two which are lying on top so this one is the color essence uh, nail polish and the number is M1 which is called pink petal that's the name I don't know why they have given the name pink petal because it's silver and this is what I'm having on my nails right now this is the color that I'm wearing on my nails currently which is called pink petal and it is by color essence really good brand pigment uh, the opacity of these nail polishes are good and they are really inexpensive then I have a top coat from color bar obviously because you know we want the nail polish to last long so I just have a top coat. then I have this nail polish from L'Oreal and the shade is called insolent magenta it is written right here but I'm obviously sure that the camera is not focusing and it's really small but the shade is 504 insolent magenta and it's like a I would like to call this like a mithai pink vibrant fuchsia pink color and it's got like purple reflexes in it if you can see carefully so yep that's another one this is insolent magenta yeah now it is focusing and then I have the top this top coat from uh, L'Oreal as well and this is like their glitter top coat mostly for um, nail art I don't do nail art obviously but yeah this is really nice to throw onto the nails if you need a little bit of uh, sparkles okay so now we I have this cans 2016 L'Oreal nail polishes all of them I have shown in some of my social media we'll start with this one this is called uh, 460 uh, the shade is called red dot and it's a beautiful red color I bought this because for Diwali Karvachot I love to flaunt such colors and these colors will look really good on the legs so that's the reason I bought this shade and it's gorgeous Next up is a 300 uh, walk on the beach and it's a beautiful cream colored uh, nail polish. I don't know how gorgeous this shade can be. It's, my camera is not even doing justice because it ain't focusing. Focus. Yep, that's the shade. It's really pretty and um, you know, it's just a nice pastel color, English color. I really love this. Quite addicted to pastels as you can already see from here. So yeah, this is again a 300 walk on the beach. Next is 580 because you are worth it. Because you're worth it. And this is like a bronzy gold color. I showed this in my haul video on my YouTube channel. So yep, that's what this is. Next is number 330, uh, Smell the Roses, and it's a beautiful English pink color, pastel pink. It's so gorgeous for an everyday wear, and I can't wait to try these nail polishes on. It's a beautiful English color. Next is number 380, Butterfly Kisses, and this is what it looks like. It's a really pretty girly pink color again really go gorgeous for everyday wear so yeah this is butterfly butterfly kisses this one is in the shade uh, 560 Gracian goddess and it's a really pretty gray with blue tones to it so it's kind of like almost a bluish gray color awesome shade and I don't have anything like this in my collection so I can't wait to wear this on and the last L'Oreal uh, Cannes collection nail polish I have is 107 Royalty Reinvented which is a beautiful purple color. I was wearing this in my previous video as well and it's gorgeous. I mean you know words even can't describe to how addicted I got to this shade and I still am. Okay so I have these last nail polishes which are in the Ferrero Rocher box. So I have few Lacme and then few miscellaneous. So we'll start with Lacme. This is their color crush uh, nail polish and the number is 43. They don't have names which sucks. But this is also like a beautiful English rose color. Really good for everyday wear and it makes the hands look very delicate and very girly. Next is uh, number 56 and this is like a metallic -y blue color this is not one of the best colors I picked up I'm not a fan of this color I thought it will look good and it looks good not that bad but it's not one of my favorite polishes yeah this is again number 56 
The last Lakme nail polish is from their True Wear range, and this is number one, Sabya Sachi. It's a beautiful, kind of like a truffle brown color. Looks so good on hands, and I really love these kind of subtle everyday wear shades. And brown kind of works really well with the Indian skin tones. So yeah. And I have this color bar nail polish. This is from their Metallics range, and this one is number 003, Pink Swan, Pink Smith. If you can read it, because of the sticker is really weird. Yeah, it's number 003, Pink Smith, and it's like this metallic-y pink color, light pink metallic color. This is relatively new, so I can't wait to try this onto my nails. I really love this one. And I have. Um, Faces uh, nail polish. This is in the number 137 Marcella, which is like the color of the year, I think 2016 only. And it's like a, well, it's a Marcella color, so yeah. It's really dark, good for the nail, hand nails as well as legs. Then I have this nail trend nail polish. You get these at the Reliance stores. And this one is in the shade B01 Coffee Brown. These type of colors actually my mom, mom likes a lot so I buy these for her and then I like the shade on her nails and I'll instantly go and buy. Obviously I got these two for 50 rupees so they are highly inexpensive um, and, and the, the quality is really good. And the last is my favorite maroon from Color Essence. Uh, this one is M32 Blush Mar. I don't know why that funny name. But it's a gorgeous, like you can see, deep maroon color. I wear this a lot for my Karvachot on my legs. And even generally, I wear such shades on my legs only. So, yep. So, these are the nail polishes that were kept in this plastic pouch. So, we'll quickly go through them. No particular order. This is the VOV nail polish, their power lasting collection. They don't have a name or they may have and it might have come out because I got from local beauty store. But this is also like you can see a dark pink color. Um, again, I wear it for my on my legs. I have two Avon nail polishes and they are the two ever I have tried. This one is Midnight Blue and this one is Midnight Plum and as you can see they are deep like dark blue and dark plum colors. We, I used to love these shades but right now I've not reached out for them in a really long while. So yeah, but they're not dried and that's why I have still kept them. Next is this nail polish from Colorama and this shade is called Sexy I believe. And this is like you can see a bright fuchsia pink color. From Colorama I have another blue and one of my I think last blues in my collection. Uh, this one is kind of like a navy blue color. Um, again this shade is called Marine Ho uh, which is mentioned right here you can see the shade is called Marine Ho. Uh, not again one of my favorite blues but whatever I've still kept it because we can wear it once in a while. Then I have two color essence nail polishes again from the families of pink. This is a br bright pink and this is a little darker pink like a plummy pink and yeah this shade is called the brighter one is called M2 Raspberry so that's what this shade is Raspberry and then this one is called well look at this sticker <laughs> this is called Grape Crush so yeah, that's kind of like a grape color. The last color essence nail polish is this. This one is M31. The shade is called Current and it's kind of like a, a rustic, rusty color, like a coppery orange color. Uh, looks good for the summers. This is the VOV nail polish obviously as you can see it doesn't have a number and this is like a beautiful metallic-y grey color with silver tones to it but it's more grey dominant. So yeah this looks good on the hands as well as legs for if you want to flaunt some metallic hands someday definitely you can give these a try and VOV ones are really inexpensive as well. Then my two <laughs> L'Oreal nail polishes, um, this one is in the shade 404 Scarlet Wham, yep Scarlet Wham which is this right here and it's like you can see a, a really um, kind of a, 
um, what do you call this color Rani pink sort of a color I don't know how to call it in English I'm bad at describing colors <laughs> I'm sorry it's like a deep like a red and a dark pink mixed together and then this one is number 602 pearl da jade I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right yeah 602 pearl da jade and this is like a nice mint color really apt for the summers this next polish is also by VOE and this one is number 134 emerald fashion yeah this is the shade 134 emerald fashion and it's a beautiful purple with shimmers in it looks really pretty on the hands as well as legs and obviously the last nail polish that you're seeing here is by Nika. this I have shown in my haul this is a recent collection uh, purchase this is number 63 and the shade is called Hawaiian Punch and it's a beautiful vibrant summer color so that is my nail polish collection video I hope you have all liked it and I'll see you soon in my next video till then you guys take care bye